Good morning, everyone. Pastor Corey Rowan here with Yorkshire First Midvale and Newport United Methodist Church wishing you a happy Resurrection Day. And our verse is Matthew 28, verses 5 and 6, where it says, The angel said to her, Do not be afraid, for I know whom you look for, Jesus Christ, who has been crucified. He isn't here. He is alive. He is risen from the dead, just as he said he would. And what a big amen that is. The resurrection is the single most important event in human history. Paul tells us that, that if Jesus was not raised from the dead, then all of our preaching would be foolish. And Paul says, I would be the, the, the most foolish of all of you. Because without the resurrection, there is nothing. Without the resurrection, Jesus is just another martyr who dies on the cross. Without the resurrection, Jesus is just like you and I who, who died and we, as we all die. But what sets him apart as God and Lord is the fact that he was raised from the dead. The fact that he did not stay dead. Making the resurrection the single most important event in human history. In fact, it, it, it works together with the crucifixion to perfectly atone for our sins. You see, in dying on the cross, Jesus defeated our sins and paid the penalty for our sins. But in his resurrection, he gave us new life. And now we have new life in him. And all who believe in Jesus have access to that new life. And this resurrection is what we celebrate each and every resurrection day. But it is truly what we celebrate each and every Sunday because that is the reason we are all here to gather together. That is the reason we can praise God. That is the reason that we can have a relationship with God. Because a Savior died and rose from the dead, defeating sin, defeating death, and, and showing us the path to new life. And so my message for you today is this, is celebrate the risen Lord. And as Paul says, live as citizens of heaven. If Jesus died for us and rose to life for us, that means we ought to live for him. He bought us and he raised us to new life. Now we are dead to our sins and alive in Christ Jesus. And so celebrate this day and every day by faithfully serving the Lord who died for you and who rose again. Amen.